M0FXB. Let's factory reset our Kenwood TS2000 nice and easy. Just turn it off. Hold down the A equals B and then turn on. Keep your finger on. And then it says full reset here and it's telling you push A equals B. Like so, and it's now completely factory reset and you've lost all your memories. Let's try and put it into demo mode. So we'll turn it off, hold down the function, turn it on, keep your finger on, and look, you've got dolphins there. And it's now going to cycle through all the different lights. And how cool is that? Looks nice in the shop. All those years ago, but this this one, I'm so lucky with this radio. It doesn't pretty, it, it looks pretty much the same as it did when it was sold. And I'm pretty sure it's 2006, and look at it. So I feel very lucky to have this set. And I've, you know, I've got it for a very good price from Martin Lynch. Okay, so let's just turn it off, hold down the function, and then turn back on. That gets rid of the, yeah, the demo mode. And then we can start adding some memory channels now. Just turn it up. Shack in the box, of course. Two antennas. Let's turn it down. Let's go to Hubnet. So to get that, we're going to go to the sub. And we can go enter. Four, three, four dot five five zero enter and you know i've got so many different radios but i'll tell you what i would say the kenwood ts2000 is probably my favorite radio of all time and that's a big say i've got some nice sets here as you can see we've also got the icom 7610 and the yesu 101 but this shack in the box is my favorite radio of all time bye for now